It's that time of the year, isn't it? You know, where we enjoy a little tipple. Not yes. Not of course. I know. Mm -hmm. I'm basically teetotal in the sense. <laughs> no, I can't. No, I can't. <laughs> no, you know, the old drop of cider now yeah. and then, and then I wake up in the field, you know. <laughs> It's only time I'd ever drink more wine, for sure. Oh, oh, any other it's, it's like drinking warm cough medicine. Believe <laughs> <laughs> me, I know. Oh, yeah. Now, uh, do you like mulled wine? I just like it, just for Christmas, it just gets you in that kind of... It, I don't like the taste, but it's just kind of... It, knowing that it's Christmas. Oh, yeah. I can hear that lovely, cheerful noise of the clack of bottles. <laughs> <laughs> because we've got two of the country's top barmen to help create some festive cocktails to get us in the mood for Christmas. Will you please welcome the Bar Wizards? Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> so we got the sour and the sweet. Uh, now we need some strong, so I'm going to put a nice plug of gin. Oh, I don't like gin. You don't like gin? It makes me dry. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Cranberry and raspberry tea bags and that have steeped uh, and just filled it with water so it's nice and healthy. And then, um, well, and then just some star release, uh, just some spicy oh, oats. <laughs> 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 and then a nice gin punch, garnish with a bit of spice, a bit of cinnamon, and uh, be strong. nutmeg. This is going to put airs on your chest. Time now to meet my nephew. As the leader 